This video is for South Coast Winery in Temecula. This is the concert venue, wedding venue, lower level lawn and seating waterfall area. Landscape lighting options. So here there's this beautiful water fountain and we could put lights down in the water depending on if you have fish in there or not to light up these stones and boulders. It looks like there's a few lights on there right now, but um, with a couple more strategically placed, it'll look stunning. People will come up, want to come over here and take photos. Again, you've got some boulders over here. Boulders look great with lights on them. There's this cool pine tree right here. The main point of this particular area are these trees. So you have about maybe 10 to 15 of them. And up above, they're really cool, uh, especially in the um, time of year where they don't have as many leaves. Right now, they seem to have a lot of leaves. Maybe they'll be dropping them as it turns fall. Right now, it's summertime. And uh, when you do have an event, people are sitting down here on these chairs. And so you don't want light down on the floor shooting up because that might be in their eye right here. So we'd have to mount the lights starting at that knuckle and point them up so that they go up inside the branches. So that's what we would do here. The lights, the wire would go up the trunk. The lights would all be positioned up in here and shining up through these branches, which would create a great backdrop view um, when you're sitting here and you look out this way and you see all the tops of those trees lit. Right now on the camera, it looks lit from these bistro lights, but in real life, it's not really, it's quite dark. When you look back and look at all, see how bright it is on the camera? Not really that bright when you come out here at night. Um, that tower could have lights. It looks like it's lit, but it's just having light that is shining uh, overall from the general area with lights in between those individual windows, a really tight beam, it would create art up there. Uh, it could even be a different color so it stands out and could be seen from a mile away. Um, there are wooden beams holding up the structure here. Let's see if I can right there, right there, right there. So we can actually light up those wooden beams and that this over here, by looking in this direction, would be uh, looking at a piece of art at night with lighting on these beams. All right, that would be spectacular. Same with the turret up there. There's a little bit of space in between the windows here, here, here. So that could have light depending on how detailed and, and uh, artistic we want to get. Uh, and this bridge is pretty cool too. So we could light the columns of this bridge from far away and it would be just a accent, accented um, art piece to look at from, from afar. Okay, so those are the options. Uh, oh, there's also a fountain. Look, there's a red fountain over there. So um, we could look at maybe putting some amber lights perhaps in there since it already has that red, amber, orange kind of feel. And they could be at each level if you do operate this fountain. If you don't turn it on and there's no water in it, maybe we don't do that. All right, 